ready to go extinct. What are you, like 15 years old? I don't have to fight you. Yeah, you do. I'm not ready to go extinct. I need to protect my team. Two years need you. The Highlanders are still here. The Highlanders! back the goons are back and hey they're in our studios i'm so happy to be joined now by jay baruchel ndg zone jay baruchel mm -hmm. and also sean william scott thank you so much for joining us uh first off you know we're a montreal morning show we don't always have access to the biggest stars i'm gonna say this you guys are the biggest stars that have ever been in our studios uh, we've been biggest huge. stars ever been <laughs> yeah <laughs> in the history of media we're the most famous two people there are so pinch yourself elias uh, i am pinched and also uh, sequel to a movie, first off, Goon, the first one, it seemed to me like when you were making the movie, it was all fun, you had s such a blast, and now all I keep reading about is that in the sequel, you still had more fun, more fun, more fun. W what is it like when you get to work on a film that's just fun? I, you said it, man. <laughs> I, I mean, I, I, I've been saying it since we finished the movie. It was, like, it was the most fun I've ever had, and I've had a lot of fun in my life you know it was it was, it was a ball I, I think it makes for good copy to hear about like a set full of people that hate each other um i wish that was the case for entertainment's sake um because it just wasn't it was like the yeah it was a blast it was lovely uh, barry ontario in the middle of the summer we'd be indoors skating, come outside, it'd be summertime, have a barbecue, everyone brought their dogs. It was, uh, it was pretty lovely. Making a, making a film in Canada, A, it's not easy. Getting the money, rounding it up. Took four years to, to write this I, film. Yeah. Uh, Jay, your first time directing. Yeah. So what was the process? You know, I know it's, it's easy to say, hey, I had a lot of fun, so yeah. let's do this again. Yeah. But before you can have the fun, you got to do a lot of work. Yeah, I don't think people realize how much every movie is a miracle, even, even bad ones. Yeah. So if you see a movie and you hate it and you think it's terrible, that was somebody's passion. They spent years, a bunch of people spent years trying to get it together. Most movies die and don't happen, right? How many mm -hmm. movies have you signed on to that didn't happen? Like, yeah, right? Like, yeah, same. And so, yeah, you, you, it's, it's about long gaming, and you just keep fighting a bunch of battles, and then hopefully you've won the war and a movie comes out. Uh, Doug the Thug, as you're known in the film, mm -hmm. uh, how easy was it convince you to, to do this one? Pretty easy. <laughs> I mean, the first movie was a huge opportunity for me. You know, I've uh, pretty much played variations of the same character throughout my whole career, and that's been fun. But like, uh, this was uh, the first time around was um, was really special for me. And then to revisit that character that has been really a, a big part of my career now, especially because the script for the sequel and the first one was great too, but the sequel is just so incredible and then to work with Jay and everybody's back. How is know. he a director working with incredible. Jay? Incredible. Wait to see the film. He just, he's meant to do this. Were you worried though? Like, hey, we had so much fun, but now my relationship's going to be different with Jay because he's a director or is it just the nap? No, I mean, we all got even closer. You know, he's, it was just, it was one of those, it, well, the great thing is the movie turned out great because you can also have a ball shooting it <laughs> yeah. and then movie sucks. Yeah. <laughs> and it exceeded my expectations and they were pretty big. What is it about Goon that it's become a bit of a cult classic, right? And I know we don't have that many hockey movies that exist out there. You know, baseball gets a ton of movies, yeah. football gets a ton of movies, not that yeah. many hockey, even basketball gets a ton of movies, yeah. not that many hockey movies. That's right. Uh, so what is it about Goon that just has been a hit with audiences for why? I, I, think, um, I think that in Canada we have very good BS detectors. <laughs> And I think that, especially watching something that Canada knows as well as hockey, um, if, it, if the hockey isn't sexy and fast and vivid and brutal, um, we don't tolerate it. And also, I think that we're used to, I think a lot of Canadians don't see themselves reflected on some of our TV shows and some of our movies. And so when something like Goon comes along and people hear people talk like their friends and their family, I think, uh, I think it connects to them. And, and it's also really funny, too. It's also just so a funny, funny, funny movie. You know? yeah. But also yeah. acting on ice, that's got to be difficult, right? That's, uh, you know, that, it's acting, already difficult enough. I don't know if I call it acting. <laughs> <laughs> Shade Snail yeah. uh, trying not to ruin the movie. Yeah, so the blood and <laughs> stuff ice. is real, right? <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Uh, Minnesota, you grew up in Minnesota. 
Yeah. So, uh, hockey, your DNA? I know this guy is. <laughs> I really wish it had been. Uh, we, <laughs> we all, been we all assumed it was. <laughs> we all I just, told him it was, but <laughs> I tried to get the job. I was like, I'm awesome. We all just took it for I granted and yeah. were, I guess, like very racist towards Minnesota because we just assumed you knew how to skate. <laughs> yeah, they, they found that out uh, pretty quickly that I was pretty bad. How is it working yeah. with a bunch of Montrealers? You know, like on the cast and, and yeah. the crew and the Canadians. How was that? It was great. I mean, I'm assuming you're all awesome yeah. because that's my only experience now. But uh, yeah, I mean, everybody's. It was what about awesome. immigration? You think about immigration to this country? Huh? Thoughts? Perhaps? Are you asking me to move? Yeah, yeah move I'm it? asking you to move. Dude, uh, or were you asking his thoughts on immigration? I was like, wait, I wanted him to go the there. Guy. I wanted him to go there, but I wasn't going to say it. Uh, Jay, before we go, uh, the Habs. Yeah. On a current big, huge winning streak. But, you know, three weeks ago, yeah. uh, things weren't so good. You're always outspoken. You love your Habs. What are your thoughts on the Habs? Uh, better than they used to be a few weeks ago. Um, we, have, <laughs> we finally, you know, we have a, a coach I enjoy much more than the previous <laughs> one. Uh, no, I'm, all of it, uh, there's, a, there's a slight chip on my shoulder because of a certain trade that happened last summer that I will never get over completely. <laughs> yeah. and, um, and I don't think I'm Trust the only me. one. Uh, you're not the only one. Yeah, yeah. so... Um, <laughs> So it's just one of those things that, like, I, I keep saying, I'm channeling my dad here. Sometimes I just wish I was a fan of a normal team. Yeah. <laughs> hey, I, I'm seriously, I <laughs> right? can sort of deal with the normal stuff you know, and not the craziness. You know what I mean? Uh, hey, 40 year anniversary of Slapshot, right? This, this year, 40th year, another yeah. legendary oh. hockey movie. Right. Uh, I got to wrap this up, but as you look at that film and, and, and Paul Newman, you think you're going to be making some salad dressings in the future? What's your future hold? <laughs> well, that's the goal. That's the goal. I mean, I get Scott compared Tone. to Paul Newman a lot. Scott Tone? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> you what? You, I was going to say, you're the Paul Scott Newman Agood. Yeah. Not a bad place to be. Scott Tone gravy, Scott Tone. Oh, yeah. Dude, let's do this. Scott's own gravy. Yeah. Uh, Anybody want to invest in Scott's own? No? No, no, no. I don't either. Yeah, I'll uh, do another American Punk My movie. friends, <laughs> my goons, we're out of time. Goon, the last of the enforcers in theaters soon. Thanks so much. For Thank you for having Thanks. us. Thanks. Cheers.